this is my car. It's a 2020 Mercedes-Benz AMG GLC 63. It has a twin turbo V8, made it to a nine-speed multi-clutch transmission that does something really cool. It will do a launch mode, which will send this car from zero to 60 in 3.8 seconds. Now what's crazy is I've owned this car for three years and I have never once done a launch with this car with Veronica Vanessa in it. Now I've launched it, but they've not experienced it for themselves. So in this video, at the end of the video, I'm gonna take Veronica Vanessa for a ride and I'm gonna not tell them that I'm gonna do it and just see what their response is to see what the reaction is to see this car and how fast it actually really is. But in the meantime, I'm gonna show you a few things that I just love about this car. The first thing I love about it is it has a V8 and uh, it sounds amazing. Listen to the way this thing sounds. That is like muscle. You hear that? That's in this SUV. It's amazing. I, I can't remember what the quarter mile time is and I'll put the time up here exactly, but it's either a little under 12 seconds or, ru or roughly close to an 11 second car. So it is very, very fast, but it sounds really cool. In fact, I have to warn people when I start it because it's so loud <laughs> that it'll scare people when it starts up. It's the coolest thing. So that, I, that's the first thing that you need to know about this car is it is a lot of muscle. It is super responsive and super fast and sounds really cool. Also, because it's an SUV, the police don't look at you as much as they would like a, a red Corvette or Ferrari. So you can get away with a lot more with it. It's really fun, it's a great car. But check that out, listen to that. I'm gonna go rev it up for you. You ready? Oh. Need I say more? Need I say more? Okay, so I get it. All you car guys are out there going, yeah, it's got a V8 in it, but it's still an SUV. All right, fine. I, I'll give it to you. I'll, I'll give you that. It is an SUV, but it doesn't perform like an SUV. It's one of the smaller ones in the lineup for Mercedes, and it is quick, it's agile, and the look of it is absolutely pretty muscular for an SUV. I think it's a really cool looking car. What's even better, it is a Mercedes, and it's very luxurious inside. Let's go for a ride. It is luxurious in every way. The seat is amazing. It is a, it's a racing seat. It just, it holds you in place. Um, it's easy to get in and out of every day. You could drive this thing every day and not have a single problem at all, just driving. It has a heads up display. Uh, we'll show you directions. We'll show you performance features. If you're on the track, it will do a number of things like that, which is really, really, really cool. Um, I have not tracked this car yet. I want to take a drag racing and see what the actual um, quarter mile time would be for just kind of a normal driver like myself. That's what it sounds like. The shifts are crisp. It has that nice little backfire. I mean, it's incredible. I'll put it in manual mode. There, There's, you know, fourth gear. You put you downshift. It just has a lot of horsepower, a lot of pop. On the highway, in normal driving conditions, I mean, you just ease the throttle on and you can jump five miles an hour like like no, nobody's business. But again, it's a it's an SUV, so you just kind of blend into traffic and no one really knows that you have a fire-breathing monster under the hood that you can just tap into at any given moment. So and then when you just want to go back to normal, switch it back to comfort mode, and there you go. Nice and easygoing, luxurious Mercedes-Benz. There's no longer, no longer offering these cars in uh, a V8. It's all four cylinder, hybrid. They're just as fast, but it's not as cool. Sorry, it's just not as cool. Mercedes, you done messed up. If you're gonna get rid of the V8, you just done messed up, all right? It, it does everything well. You can have fun in it. You can go racing around town. It hauls five people plus luggage, <laughs> you know, it, and it looks great. It's, it's very muscular feeling. Uh, when you put it in sport mode, yeah, okay, it doesn't handle like a Corvette or Ferrari or anything like that, but it does what you want it to do for the average guy. I'm not going to go out and put this thing on the track, but if I need to go fast, I want to go fast, want to have a little fun shifting gears, the transmission, get that nice little burble, the pop and everything out of the motor, um, it makes you feel really, really cool. Now I'm going to go pick up Veronica and Vanessa. It's probably going to be a day or two uh, when I have opportunity to put them in the car. We're going to try to launch this thing and um, 
get their reaction and also get kind of their feedback on what they think this car what they think about this car so um i'm doing a review on this car okay just a quick review and i just thought it would be cool you know because you guys have this was this is our car i was just curious you know what are the things that you really like about this car what's oh there's a lot i really like the lights inside <laughs> <laughs> well when it's nighttime and like it's lit up like really really cool that is like and then the lights on the doors too that shine the emblem of the mercedes yeah it is it makes you feel like 10 times cooler showing up places or like getting out of your car i don't know it's just like it's super super cool looking so i really love that i love how fast it is mm -hmm. like you know the different levels and stuff and then you can turn on the thingy my bobber the goes, exhaust like, pop, 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 pop. yeah that thing <laughs> That's really cool when you can do that. Um, makes it feel really like fast and fun and like sports car-y. Um, I also like the buttons on the... <laughs> on the steering wheel? No, yeah, no, these things right here. Oh. Ooh, oh, I yeah. love those because they're like the little mouse. The they are a little mouse. It's like a little mouse on, on each well, side. Well, you know you can you can scroll all the way over and control that too, right? Yes, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. That's like, it feels so nice to be able to like just go... It goes over to the screen over yeah. here and stuff. Yeah, I like that a lot. I like the... the I, honestly, everything about this car I really like down to like the little details of like um, the seat where you can move it, move it forward and back. And even the headrest can go down, which is really up high for some reason. Yeah. And like, yeah. I don't know. There's just, there's a lot I like about it. Right. I, I think for me... Oh, in the backup camera. Oh, in the backup camera? Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah, with it hovering above. Yes. Yeah, that's a good feature. Well, it's a 360 camera, so it, it sees all the way around. Yes, yeah. but I've done many tests with it to actually see, like, how does it know what is actually around me? Because it looks like it's filming from above, right? And you're like, how is it doing that? What I like about this car, um, I haven't been able to drive it as much as you guys have. Yeah. But what I do like about it is the speed of it um, compared to the Audi that I drive. Um, oh. Like, this is like a sports car. Like, you can get going pretty quick. Whereas, like, the Audi, it feels like it's kind of like... Ugh! And then it gets to the speed you want, you know? Yeah. So this just like, you know, you get to your speed right away. It feels a bit safer on that side. Like, I know that it's a bit mis... Where are you going? Oh, I'm sorry. I just want to take a little detour here. Wait, where did... Sorry. Is this where? Are Why we... are you stopping? What are you... Oh, oh my gosh! <gasps> ah! <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> Wait, there... No, they were they were fine. Oh gosh! <laughs> I feel like I was on a roller coaster. So that's that's the race launch mode. Wow! What the? You, that was fast. Why did you do that? Because I wanted to see. I wanted to get your guys' reaction. Uh, well, How fast I, did we get to sixty within those seconds? Well, this goes from zero to sixty in three point eight seconds. I have a confession to make. What? I've done something similar like that before. Well, yeah. Like that. Exactly that. But you've With never put car. it in. You've never put it in race mode where it comes up and says race launch. No, probably in like sport plus mode. No, but it, you have to do a specific sequence. Oh no, no, no! I don't do well, it like that. That was that but, was wow. crazy. That was like really like a. I don't know. It felt like someone pushed me. My neck is like hurting. <laughs> it like it feels like it shoots you Thanks. out of a. Thanks for the warning. Sorry. And that's my review of my car. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to subscribe and give this video a like. Also, just remember this. Cars are replaceable. This car is replaceable. You are not. So be safe. Wear your seatbelt. Use your turn signal. And we love you. And have an amazing day. And thanks for watching. See you guys next time.